Burhau and Holdeman. Fife inside with the spin move, and he gets the basket in one. Columbia. Let the guy from North Carolina be their roommates. Pretty cool, those three freshmen. There's Fife with the spin, splits the double team and scores. Yeah, Brown checked in for Kimmon, so Green back running the point. Fife, the left hander, going to work, spinning, shooting, oh. scoring. So if he gets doubled, he's going to kick it out. Three quick fouls on Benson this half. Has to go to the bench. Fife, nifty move. <laughs> Fife had set the screen and then Tran Powell's worked on his body and now he's got some NBA scouts looking at him. And he went on the neutral system plan. He's a star in the making. It was peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. <laughs> and Fife. Missouri State. Fife, the offensive rebound. Uh, games averaging four points a game. Already up to 14. Excellent defense on Green. Fife, 50 move. Another Northern Iowa turnover leads to an easy one for SIU. Fife, spinning and scoring. He has. Jumpers round, no. Fife offensive rebound. Wow, what a way to stick with it. Got so much better because they needed him. He's got all those intangibles. And he's a mature upperclassman point guard. Fife again. Northern Iowa. The two guys went after Robbins and blocked him out. A good, good take by Ted. Double handed dig, and then Fife just stayed right with the reason why he could be a pro, though, Kevin. Fife, he pins Robbins deep. Pins with one word. Winner. Fife, again. Footwork. Let's see, that thing got partially blocked there by Murphy. And another <laughs> offensive rebound. And Fife goes to work in the hole with one to go. Burhau for the steal. And Fife off the miss shot. 2008. Tall order. They're going to have to win four games in a row. You and I will be positioned with a number one seed, regardless of what happens here today. Yeah. And also a Missouri State team that's been coming on of late. So they were picked to win it. Fife just got away from his defense. A real talent. He's been out 12 games with a back injury. Third game back. Fife with three on the shot clock. Backs his way. Winless. I tell you, they are a dangerous team. They had Indiana State on the ropes on Sunday. Look at that. Couple of shots. And we're halfway through this first half. Kimmins, wow, he attacks hard. Cunliffe and Newton with nine. Fife going right to work on that block. Over the outstretched oh, field. Yeah. Won it 39 times. And last year, Riffick year, 22 and five, leading the Valley at 11 and four. Brown looking to make it two in a row. Another offensive rebound for Fife. Backing his way in off glass and in. Set up the secondary break. Pitching the shutout three minutes in so far. Nice look to fight. Who will lay it in? Green, nice feed to fight. Rolling to the rim for a score. And they've gone eight minutes without a single point. A 19-0 run. Fife trying to end it. And he does. Time this season. Pounded inside for Fife. Benson has two quick fouls. Fife will bank yeah, it in. Can go into Brown and Fife each with 14. Burhau to the rim. Fife tips it in.
The glass elite defender for the Ramblers. Off to a fast start. Austin Fife. Yeah, Willis Reed time. on the bench is going <laughs> to limp in with that bad wheel. Great start for the Ramblers. Three turnovers for Northern Iowa and no rebounds thus far either. Here's a knock because he's such an outstanding passer. Long three for Green. Rebound Fife. Yes, on the How about fall. another basket in the Redbirds. Horn is three of four from the floor, leading them with eight early points. Five, 66% from the floor, 57% behind the arc. And they, a good take by Haldeman, misses. About seven and a half minutes to go here. Good unselfish play by Pick. Horn has 11. So the two players we put the spotlight on in the pregame show, leading their respective teams. Great yeah. post entry by Brown there. Sometimes the entry pass to the post is no shot. So can Isaiah Brown, a little strong off the backboard. <laughs> Look at Austin Fife. The big Redbird bounce. Gets it back to just a 10 point deficit. Idowo with the tip in. Family. His uncles, Ed Conroy, assistant at Minnesota. His other uncle, Duffy Conroy, assistant at Louisiana Tech. Fife trying to work against Robbins and gets it to roll home. At will. Get that slithery game. <laughs> Five held to just two. This time he gets Robbins back for Drake. Silent to that one. Five going Robbins has three. Iowa has the ball on the two-point lead. Burhouse, the three-point line. Haldeman inside. He threaded the needle. Burhouse. Comes out to help out. All the way in, and Cummins got a hand on the ball, but the fuck it. Oh, inside. You want to get complacent. You want to stay in that attack mode. Burhau to a cutting fight. It's their senior year, just about got one as juniors as well. Got upset. Here's the feed to Fife inside. Green getting a lot of attention. Got Josh Hall at 6-7. Guarding Green. Look at the feed those in times. But the barrage of threes have hurt him. And there's that. If they continue to double Green. There's Brown. The feed. And the use of the window. The dump off for Fife. The bucket and a late push. Good job by Northern Iowa, keeping the possession alive with eight on the shot clock. Fife backing in front wave. Marquee matchup off plus and in. I like to throw because it takes the pressure. It just takes the pressure off of them. He had made 44 in a row. A school record. Fife off the feed. Three today. They'd love to see him get going. Fife seals, missed the layup. Front wing also the shot. Fife gets it back and scores. Stepping up. Brown shooting a three, rimming out. Contested an offensive rebound for Fife, something he does so well. Burhau to Fife. Burhau. Burhau from the double team, leaving Brown open low. And a left hand shot. To Fife banging into Benson. Left hand shot. He got the crawl. Clock gets something inside. Brown against Damask with the fadeaway. And the offensive rebound for Fife to Burhau. Points one in the second half. And that was the heat check that Coach Mullins did not want. Green trying to create, gets an assist. Eight minutes. Trying to see if they can come back from a double digit deficit. Brown dumping the pass for Fife. To break for SIU, they could set their defense on the dead ball. There's Fife with a handoff for Green. Green low for Fife. Now Bradley, catch ball at 17 feet. Now here's Fife. 
I want to work inside. Yes. Five. Five. Again, five. There'll be no double. Five. Again. Yes. Now Fife is left. Missed opportunity by Bradley. Top of nine has man off his feet. Great penetration. Oh, nice pass inside. Brown. Fife working for real estate inside. He's got it. Ray Burhau on the post for Fife. Fife coming back from a serious injury last year. And a good left. I must say the Panthers are playing just as well defensively. A lot of the reason for the offensive blows for Illinois State is because of the Panthers' defense. Fife took it all oh, after the day. <laughs> Haldeman is going to try a pull-up jumper with Fisher on him. It's going to be tipped up and in Jeez. by Fife. Christmas. Blumberg and Wade and for the UNI Panthers you have Green, Burhau, Brown, Haldeman and this is Austin Fife and nine with initially was a three toe was on the line as they reviewed it pulled it so off the, the board. So at the old it would have broke Cam's record. I like it. it. And you'll also share it for a few minutes when Kimmons was in there for Northern Iowa. Boy, Fife has that determined look in his eyes. Going to work and going to the line. And it's make him shoot over you. That's their philosophy. <laughs> Tough pass to Matthews. He caught it, but didn't finish. A.J. Green with a nice find and an easy lay-in. Both of these teams have played more minutes than they've scored points in our first half. Good pass. Fife the catch and the basket. Burhau and Holdeman. Fife inside with the spin move, and he gets the basket in one.